Well, thank you guys so much. Uh, it, you know, that song is just a great song, and it's such a feel-good song. And, uh, you know, to have those horns there tonight definitely made it, made it pop for me and definitely added a whole new energy and element to the song that I only dreamt of, you know. Uh, and uh, I, think, I think it went well. I, I haven't watched it back yet, but I, I can't wait. Can't wait to. So. But yeah, Christina, you know, Christina uh, said she's, she's seen growth in me. And, you know, it was definitely, definitely good to come back this week after what she said last week and have her, you know, praise, say good things. So I definitely feel very proud and accomplished for that. And grateful, you know, to her. Yeah, you know, he wanted to see, uh, he said he, you know, I was there playing the whole time. He just wanted to see more out of the performance, you know, maybe later on in the song. You know, I, I honestly don't know 100% what he meant, but if I had to guess, I would say that he just wanted to see me come out of that, you know, just standing there the whole time. Because, you know, I haven't played guitar since the, the blind audition. So he, he's been seeing me work the stage and kind of, and there I was just, you know, staying still and I couldn't really mingle with the crowd or anything. So maybe, maybe that's what he meant. I don't, yeah, and it ended up happening. Yes, I, yes. And at the time I, I had no idea it was a song, no idea. So it works out, you know? Actu actually, uh, last Wednesday, we had a, a meeting with Blake, you know, Team Blake's all still here, let's have a meeting and, and talk with them, and that's, they showed it tonight. Let's all sit in the room with our guitars, and at the time, I didn't even know the song, what song I was doing. They were like, bring your guitars in the morning, so I was like, hopefully I know the song on guitar when I get there, you know? And it just so happened I did, so it worked out, yeah. I, would, I definitely wouldn't mind trying other styles, you know, I, uh, I like so many different types of music, uh, but this is definitely, I feel like this is definitely my thing and, and what I want to do. Uh, if I had a, if I had my say, I'd have you know horns, you know, throughout my whole set and just you know just keeping soul alive. That, that's that's what I want to do. You know, that that's the music that I connect with. And you know, Otis Redding was one of the biggest influences on me. And I mean, to accomplish as much as he did by the age of 26 is mind-boggling. You know, and uh, he's definitely king me, uh, David Ruffin from The Temptations, one of the greatest vocalists as well. Uh, I'm a huge Stevie Wonder fan, you know, it's, it, it's so, it's different, different style. Uh, so yeah, I can go on for days, uh, Donny Hathaway, you know, all these, all these old school cats are just, uh, you know, Percy Sledge, like, so many greats. Uh, but today, you know, it's cool because it, it, it's becoming cool again, you know. Uh, the whole, it's like retro soul, Bruno Mars, Justin Timberlake's latest stuff is, you know, is really going back, back in time and I feel like it's the perfect time for me to, to be in this competition and, you know, I, I'm connecting with that, so.